Hello there, welcome to another video of SwiftGet. In this video, we're gonna take a look about how to add packages in Xcode project by using GitHub and also how to add packages locally. So after adding, how we gonna use that and uh, that's gonna be going to do it over here. So let's start doing it. First of all, I have created an Xcode project over here. Uh, which is a blank which doesn't have anything else inside so in order to add a package from a github what we need to do is we need to go inside this package uh, test demo and inside this you have this targets and the project file so inside the project you find here info build settings package dependencies and you can find here a plus button so we'll go to github repository and find some uh, packages over here so I have I'm going to choose here as a kingfisher let's copy this and come back to the Xcode right and uh, click this plus button so you can find here options to uh, add the packages locally uh, as so I'm going to paste this URL in this uh, package URL so let's place paste that and you can find here github alright and it's in case they it may be asking for the github uh, username and password so you can provide that and after that you can add the packages so I'm going to add over here so it's add it add package so now the package has been implemented over here it's very pretty easy and simple so then after that how we can use this is uh, let's come back to the Wii controller dot zip file and uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to import this uh, Kingfisher right and uh, try some example like a kf dot url and you can find here your or cache let's maybe uh, try to use the URL with a string it's URL and uh, let's find uh, URL of uh, string inside that you can play some URL string over here so that's how we gonna use this so if you want to use other stuffs you can refer in this game for sure github and make use of that locally Alright, so now next uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a package uh, by locally. So in order to do that, uh, I'm going to file and inside new. You can find here project track packages. So I want to create a track package over here. So I'm going to click package. And uh, I'm going to name it as uh, screen package. And I'm going to save it in my uh, iOS project folder. Let's create that. Here we go. So these are the sources by default it's provided. Uh, I'm going, not going to use this over here. I'm going to, here I want to create a new file to make a storyboard over here. So I'm clicking here iOS, click storyboard and click next. And uh, I'm going to name the storyboard as a screen dot storyboard. Let's make a uh, more smaller all right and from here I'm going to this plus button and I want to bring over here an image so let's make an image over here let's make it much more bigger all right let's put some constraints like this Add constraints, make it horizontal, vertical to the container, and uh, let me add some image from my machine. In order to do that, let's, let's add a new file, which uh, I want to add a image over here. So let, I'm checking for my assets dot catalog. Click next. So it let it be media.assets, all right, and then I'm going to drag an image from my laptop. So, why is this? Let me add an image over here. And uh, let's come back to the screen.storyboard and uh, let me find the image in the image section. All right, let it be like this. Now next is uh, I'm going to create another file which is for the controller. So let's create a new file which will be of uh, zip. Oh, 
promoters it supports only maybe the objective C so let's make a shift file new file let it be a shift file click next so I'm going to name it as a screen BC All right, let's come back to the storyboard and before that let me do some stuff inside this uh, let me import UI kit and I'm going to create a class over here it will be a public class screen VZ which is of uh, UI view controller and inside this I'm going to write a public public static let storyboard vz equal to equal to ui storyboard name will be the storyboard name is the screen and uh, here will be until dot module we check this dot instantiate in shall be controller let me add one more guy over here which is for the public uh, unit load Just say public uh, all right. All right, let it be like this. Expected declaration. All right, so let's come back to the screen dot storyboard, and I, we need to use here public in order to call that in the another project. If you use as normal class, it won't be importing this should be in a public all right and then let's come back to this and uh, I'm going to create the class over here is uh, screen VZ screen package and the module will be the screen package and the storyboard and let it be like this all right so what we are going to do next is I'm going to import this local package uh, inside our main project which I have already shown you inside this view controller now take a look about uh, how we can add this uh, package locally so in order to do that uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to the this is the package which we have created now so just click that and drag it inside your project here we go that's it symbol we have done that and let's come back to this uh, general package uh, information in the target section and from here can find here storyboard libraries and embed content and let's add an item over here that's going to be this uh, screen package click and add symbol and now let's come back to the ob controller dot storyboard uh, let me remove this guy from here and uh, let's before that let's go to the main dot storyboard and uh, create a button over here plus button button and let's name this as to package let's make some constraints Right, and let's come go to the view controller box of file for the standard editor. Let's create an uh, action for this. Go to 
package tapped and from there let's make more space let me import this uh, package which we have created locally so the package name is uh, screen package and now what I'm going to do is let VZ will be equal to screen package dot let me go over here so they're having a screen package let's come back to this uh, we don't need this guy over here which is for the screen package let me remove this delete move to trash Package dot bc dot storyboard bc and self dot percent and I'm going to press in the view controller which is bc and make it true and completion nil. Alright, so let's run this and check. Need to force this. Alright. Uh, before running, uh, let me do one thing. We have used a force uh, present. So go back to the package uh, inside the screen dot storyboard and uh, make sure that you have checked this click which is of uh, is initial view controller you should be checking that otherwise uh, if you try to run it will crash so I have made this as initial view controller inside the screen dot storyboard let's come back to the view controller dot zip file and try to run now so let me check what we have done so far Here we have the go to the package button which I made and uh, let me click that. Here we go. This is the package we have uh, just made and this is how we're going to use package inside the Xcode project. That's all. It's very simple. So that's all in this video. So it's about uh, how we can add a package locally and also from the GitHub. So hope you have a uh, make use of this video and uh, that's all on this video thank you for watching see you in the next video